Yeah. He's talking about, yeah. Yes. Oh, yeah, you can't park here. Wow. See, it's several cops out here during the week. I mean, that don't never say nothing about us being parked here. I'm about to show you something about who the children, who the, who are Law's favorite children are. I'm going to show you. No, no, we're going to bring the Quran. We're going to show you. I must be. I am We're going to show you. I am Muslim. I am Muslim. And we're going to show you who the Muslims are. Calm down. Get out your feelings. We're about to show you who the Muslims are. We're about to show you. It's chaotic out here. We're being attacked. We're being attacked by the Muslims and, 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 and the Roman police everywhere. We're we being attacked out here. Man. They're not even letting my letting my bros park up. I ain't, you know, running them no all around, running, no running them all, running them all over the place and everything. Israelites got to follow rules too. Technically, you're not supposed to be on there. Come on, man. No amplified audio. Oh, amplified all of you. We do this every week. Every, every Saturday, though. Wow, well, we can write citation for that if you want to go there. That, we can do that. Hey, we've been out here every that's week man. since that's December 22nd. I haven't been, but now I'm out that's, here. That's, you want to talk crazy? We're going to talk crazy to him, but we're going to use the Bible. All right, listen, I'm going to eat my lunch. That's, yeah, go, 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 eat your, go eat your lunch. Yeah, we're going to get in your lunch. judgment. Yeah. Go ahead, Esau, man. The most high God hates your ass anyway, man. What are you going to do to him? I will prepare thee unto blood. What are you going to do to the white man? I will prepare thee unto blood. What are you going to do to that cop that trying to run us off the block? I will prepare thee unto blood. Man, the most high going to prepare that ass in the blood, which means you're going to be put to death, copper. The most high going to kill your ass, man, in a vicious, bloody fashion. Little home in the world of saints Don't know that the ancient of days Made this a nation of days Will be broken just to throw it away We go through these clay pots That I won't hold in that day Can't wait for that rock to drop On the feet of this mix iron and clay Plucking all the horns in the beast Grab this whore because she think She a virgin but she getting stoned Cause we had to pay And it don't blood on sheets So it's blood that we see Make you run so you weak as hell to a lie I ain't lying I'm dying to sick my teeth Biblical thugs for that day the Lord thy God hath chosen thee to be a special people unto himself above all people that are upon the face of the earth. Above all people. So God said we was above y'all, man. That's right. The three musketeers, man. Right. Right. We was, we was above y'all. We stronger. We faster. Right. Y'all women love us. Right. She got a work husband, but he ain't white. <laughs> right. right? Yeah, I know, man. They know it's the truth. Yep. Right? The Most High chose us to be a better people. That's right. A faster people. A stronger people. Above all other nations on this earth. Thank you. Thank you. So we're going to take that, man. We know who that is. Right. Right? We know who's a better people. Who's a greater people? That's right. Right? Like, look at them kids over there. And imagine Bonnie fighting her. Bagged <laughs> <laughs> all that down. Right? We just better, man. Right. That's because God said, man. Not because we said, but we know, though. Right? Let me get 2 Samuel 7 and 23. They know. You know what I mean? That's why they ain't going to watch basketball if it was all white people. Right. Hey, you ain't gonna watch basketball with all white people. That's right. <laughs> right? You gotta have blacks and Hispanics involved in this thing. Right. Right? How you doing? We usually teach her every week. They 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 don't never got an issue with us. We teach her every week, they don't ever have an issue with us. Oh. They talking about you. Yeah. Yes. Oh yeah, you can't park here. Wow. We park here every week. Yeah, I know, but that's what I was saying. Like, every week we usually teach here, they usually... We're not at here every week. They want, they want everything just clear. So where can we park? Can we park our street? Whatever's legal. Whatever's legal. All right, let me go on move. Okay. All right. See, it's several, okay, it's several cops out here during the week. I mean, that don't never say nothing about us being parked here. Oh. Okay, okay, I'll freeze. Oh, praises, but we are the Hebrew Israelites. We are not the Ishmaelites. We are not the Christians in the Christian church. We come out here to teach the truth 
to the blacks, the Hispanics, and the native Indians that y'all are God's favorite children. The Ishmaelites are a copycat. Muhammad is a thief. That's right. The pastors in the church are not telling y'all who the children of Israel are. The Imam in the masjid is not telling y'all who the children of Israel are. And that's all throughout your Quran. That's right. So the first thing the Imam should be teaching you Muslims, you blacks, Hispanics, and native Indians who calling yourself Muslims is who the children of Israel are. Because Allah claims the children of Israel as his favorite people. That's right. The Christian church doesn't claim anything. They claim confusion. That's right. I mean, they claim that you can be a homosexual and still be loved by God, but we see what God did to the homosexuals. That's right. He destroyed them. That's right. So y'all shouldn't be welcome in the so-called Christian church if that's the ways of God. Who are, are these are the Ishmaelites right here. The fake, the fake children of God. Do y'all want to hear about y'all Allah and who Allah's favorite children are? Allah's favorite children, Allah's favorite children are the Israelites. I'm, I'm Allah's favorite. No. Israelite. Yes, the Israelites. You're an Ishmaelite. You are a fake child. Look, I got to move the car, so you got to remain in control. All right, I'm not. I'm going to explain What? What you mean? Do y'all want to learn something about it? Y'all want to learn something about who who who, who a lost favorite children is? Are That's you are you an Israelite? No. All right, so let's. So, all right, all right. So let's so let's show you so, show you, so let's show you something. Correct. I'm about to show you something about who the children who the, who a lost favorite children are. I'm going to show you. No, no, we're going to bring in the Quran. We're going to show you. We're going to show you in the Quran. And we're going to show you who the Muslims are. Calm down. Get out your feelings. We're about to show you who the Muslims are. We're about to show you. Look at you. Go put a bomb on your chest. Go put a bomb on your chest and blow up some innocent people. The sword, chapter 2, verse 122. Oh, children of Israel, remember my favor which I bestowed upon you, and that I preferred you to the main cow. So, your law preferred the children of Israel of over Christ. all the Alameen in the Quran. We are a better people than y'all, according to your Quran. We're a better people. Okay, y'all the guy here, we being, we, we being attacked. We being attacked by the Muslims and, 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 and the Roman police everywhere. We, we are being attacked out here in America. Look, he all up on our platform like he want to teach and everything. Eh? Officers making me uncomfortable over here. Allah, Allah. Eh? Hey, look, they, they, they fear the children of Israel. That's right. Eh? And, 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 and they think they stopping something. They stopping the word. Eh? Stop with you. Up with you. Work it, sir. Work. Well, we working, we working too. We doing the Lord's work. I mean, because we are the children of Israel. You got to understand them about who the children of Israel are. Yeah, no, you know, because y'all don't read the Bible. But the Bible has a favorite children, and the favorite children are the Israelites. Whose salvation was created for it, but it's things we got to do to achieve it. I mean, we just can't be out here indoctrinated in everybody else's beliefs. Can't be out here celebrating all these so called holidays and everything. You are not going to be loved by the Most High, Most High God being indoctrinated and following the ways of the heathen. That's right. That is not going to get you saved. That is not going to get you a hedge of protection from the Most High God. That ain't going to do it following their ways. I mean, so we got to come up, we got to come up out of this. I mean, and there's things that we out here to teach y'all for us to come up out of this. Yeah, we want to tell, we want, we want to tell you about your Quran. That's all. Just want to give y'all some understanding about your Quran and who the children of Israel are. 
I mean, we know y'all don't want to hear it. We know y'all don't want to hear that the Israelites are God's favorite children. That's right. Allah said it. Oh, praises. Look, look, these, these police officers is running my brothers. They not they not even letting my letting my bros park up. I ain't, no, running them all around, running them all, running them all over the place and everything. Israelites gotta follow rules too, you know what I mean? Yeah, we are following the rules. We know we're in the land of our captivity, but it ain't gonna be like that forever. Technically, you're not supposed to be on there. You're supposed to be with. Come on, man. No amplified audio. Oh, oh, amplified audio. We do this every week. Every, every Saturday, though. Wow, well, we can write a citation for that if you want to go there. That, that's we can do that. Yeah, that's I don't know if that's the truth or not. We do here every week. Yeah, every Saturday. I don't know if that's the truth or not. I hear you. Yeah, every week. So what you saying right now is false information, brother. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Come on, man. Exactly false. Don't, don't, don't try right, to do that. We'll see if we get a supervisor out here. That's Take fine. care of it. Hey, that's fine. Go ahead. Go ahead, supervisor. Because what y'all saying is bullshit. Because we was out here, every, we've been out here every week since December 22nd. I haven't been, but now I'm out that's, here. That's, that's, that's you. Right. But you think, guess you think what? you're the only cop that patrol this area? You think you're the only cop that patrol this area? Do I think I'm the only one? Yeah. No, I don't. You, because right. you're not. And guess no, what? We out here every right. Saturday and they don't say right. nothing to us. There'd be people right. sitting well, I know the rules. Right I know there. you can't amplify it. So It's been amplified since we've been here. Okay. It's been amplified. Well, it ain't, it ain't, all, it ain't, it ain't that we need a mic to do this job. It's not. We don't need one to do this job because guess I mean, what? People we, still going here. We still going. No, you can do it. It's not amplified. We going to do it. Matter of fact, give me Ezekiel 35, man. Get this man his judgment, man. Get this man his judgment. Ezekiel 35, man. Let's get this man his judgment, man. Let's get this man judgment, man. He want to talk crazy. We going to talk crazy to him, but we going to use the Bible. All right, listen, I'm going to eat my lunch. Go eat your lunch. We're going to get in your judgment. Go ahead, Esau, man. The most I got hates your ass anyway, man. That's right. No, no, no. Ezekiel 35. You want to talk crazy? Guess what? We're going to talk crazy right back to you. And we're going to use the scriptures to cut your ass. Ezekiel 35 and 5, man. Read. Ezekiel 35 and 5. Because thou hast had a perpetual hatred. He always got a hatred towards our people, man. You running, you trying to run us off the butt. But we not going nowhere, dog. And has shed the blood of the children of Israel. They always trying to kill us, man. They, you looking for a reason to strike. And guess what? You ain't going to get one because the Most High God got us protected because we bringing out this word. That's Read. right. By the force of the sword in the time of their calamity. Uh -huh. In the time that their iniquity had an end. Read. Keep reading. Therefore, as I live, saith the Lord God. Right. Therefore, as the Most High God, Yahweh lives. Right. Read. That's right. I will prepare thee unto blood. Uh, prepare thee unto blood. What are you going to do to him? I will prepare thee unto blood. What are you going to do to the white man? I will prepare thee unto blood. What are you going to do to that cop that trying to run us off the block? I will prepare thee unto blood. Man, the Most High going to prepare that ass in the blood. Which means you're going to be put to death, copper. I swear. The Most High going to kill your ass, man, in a vicious, bloody fashion, man. That's judgment coming to you, right, Reed? Blood shall pursue thee. You say even blood shall pursue thee, man. So no matter what, you talking about it can't be amplified, but guess what? I bet you everybody can hear my voice right now. Right. And it's amplified without the damn mic. Right. So what you gonna say now? It's too it's still too amplified? Get the hell out of here. Give me Ezekiel 25 and 14, man. That's right. Start at 13. We're gonna give you your judgment, man. It's nothing you can do to stop this word, man. There's nothing y'all can do. Y'all listen, the reason why you try to get us up out of here because we started cutting people, man. We started cutting brothers with the Quran. Right. We started cutting y'all spirit, man. Right. But guess what? We gonna, you gonna say it's borderline hate speech, but the Most High God hates every other nation that is not the children of Israel. That's right. Read Ezekiel 25, 13. Bring it out. Therefore, thus saith the Lord God. Thus said the Most High God, right, read. I will also stretch out my hand upon Edom. Upon who? Upon Edom. The goddamn white man, right? He gonna stretch out his hand upon the white man, right, Reed? And will cut off man and beast from it. He gonna do what? And will cut off man and beast from it. So y'all gonna be put to death, man. Your animals is gonna be put to death. Not only you gonna die, white boy, with the, that's in the cop uniform, your animal's gonna die. Your right. the horses that's in the stable, right. they gonna die. Your dog, if you got one, they gonna die. Right. Your children, if you got them, 
they going to die. Right. Right. You going to be cut off forever. You going to be put to death, right? That's right. That's right. And I will make it desolate from Tamay. He going to do what? Make it desolate from Tamay. Utterly destroyed. That's what's going to happen, right, Reed? And they of Eden shall fall by the sword. And they shall fall by the sword, man, which means, yo, listen, just like how y'all like to shoot people in the back, just like how y'all like to have knees on necks, that same thing going to happen to you. Read. That's right. And I will lay my vengeance upon Edom. He going to do what? And he will lay his vengeance upon Edom. Man, the most high God, Yahweh, is going to lay his vengeance upon you white people, right, Read. That's right. By the hand of my people, up Israel. Up, up, by the hand of who? By the hand of my people, Israel. So the so-called blacks and Americans and Hispanics is going to cast the Most High God's vengeance upon white people, man. That's right. With his anger and with his fury. Read that. And they shall do an Edom according to my anger. We're going to do to Edom, you so-called white people, according to his anger. Right, Read. That's right. And according to my fury, his anger and his fury, right, Reed? And they shall know my vengeance, saith the Lord God. Man, and he said, y'all going to know his vengeance, saith the Lord God, man. So guess what? It's nothing you can say or do to stop your judgment from happening, man. Go to the book of Obadiah and read verse 18, man. This is what's coming to these goddamn white people, man. Right. You over here thinking you running something. No, the most high is running everything out here. That's right. You can't right. kick us off the block. We here every week, boy. We out here every week, white boy. Read. Obadiah 1, 18. Matter of fact, right, read verse 10. Obadiah 1 and 10. For thy violence against thy brother Jacob, read. shame shall cover thee. Man, y'all always been a shameful nation, man. Y'all always been a shameful people. Everybody look at y'all like y'all nasty, utterly filthy and disgusting, man. Y'all cause bestiality. Y'all created AIDS. Y'all created every known disease that we got today, right, Reed? And thou shall be cut off forever. And what should the white people be? And thou shall be cut off forever. Yeah, the white man gonna be cut off forever. There's nothing you can do, man. And guess what? Y'all been cut off forever, right? Read verse 18 now. Obadiah 1, verse 18. Bring it up. And the house of Jacob shall be a fire. The house of Jacob, right, Read. And the house of Joseph a flame. So the northern kingdom and the southern kingdom going to come together, right, Read. And the house of Esau for stubble. Man, they going to come together and we going to devour the so-called white man, man. We going to destroy y'all off the face of the earth, man. This is biblical prophecy. This is what's going to happen, right, Read. And they shall kindle them and devour them. Right, read. And there shall not be any remaining of the house of Esau, for the Lord has spoken it. Man, this right here is biblical prophecy, man. Y'all talk about in God we trust. But do you really do you really trust him? Because God said he gonna destroy the white people off the face of the earth using the so-called blacks, Native Americans, and Hispanic in this hemisphere, man. That's, That's right. right. Y'all gonna be utterly eradicated, man. That's it's right. It's nothing you can do. You ain't running this off this corner. We gonna stay here all day and ruin your goddamn pictures and continue to give y'all your goddamn judgment, That's man. right. All the way up until we say, all right, man, y'all done had enough. Or the most I said, all right, they done had enough, right? Give me Romans chapter, one, chapter nine. We don't want to the nine of verse one, man. Because people are going to be like, oh, man, that was the Old Testament that you read, that y'all read out of, man. That ain't true. No, it is true, man. The most I don't like these people at all. And it is, they never was ever like, man. Y'all, before, right? yeah, before y'all was even born, y'all wasn't even chosen. Before y'all was even born, y'all was destined to die. Right. That's crazy, man. Y'all was literally born to be put to death and to serve the Israelites. Right? Yeah. Read that. Romans 9 and 1. Romans 9 and 1. Right? Yes. Everybody, it's like it. Everybody, everybody's favorite person to go to and to read. Paul, right? But y'all really don't even know what Paul be talking about. Read this. Right. Romans 9 and 1. I say the truth in Christ. Uh-huh. I lie not. So he ain't lying when he writing write this. Right, Read. My conscience 
also bearing me witness in the Holy Ghost. Holy Spirit, say Holy Spirit for the people. In the Holy Spirit. There you go, read. That I have great heaviness and continual sorrow in mine heart. Read. For I could wish that myself were cursed from Christ uh, for my brethren. For his brethren, right, read. My kinsmen. His kinsmen, right, read. According to the flesh. This ain't a spiritual thing. This is a fleshly thing. This is a worldly thing, right, read. Who are Israelites? Who are who? Who are Israelites? Who are they everybody? Who are Israelites? And the Israelites is the chosen people. The Israelites is who Paul has always been talking to. The Israelites are everything, right, Reed? To whom pertain of the adoption uh -huh. and the glory Reed? and the covenants Reed? and the giving of the law Reed? and the service of God Reed? and the promises. Right, we get everything. It's nothing that y'all get, man. The so-called blacks and Americans and Hispanics in this hemisphere, we get everything, man. You other nations is going to be put to death. Y'all right. just created to go into slavery, man. That's right. We get everything. We get the glory. We get the covenants. We get the laws. We get the service of God himself, That's man. right. And all we got to do is listen to him. But just like these crackers over here, hey, yo, copper, come do your job, man. They can't park they here. They can't park there, right? They can't park here. Why are you worried about us? Look. Somebody parking park right here, there, bro. bro. Somebody parking. Come do your job. Come do your man. job. Come Yo, do your job. I can found them. Oh my bad. Hold on. You on your lunch break, right? Come now do you, your job. Uh, your stomach more important than your damn job, here. right? 